Welcome back to the next episode of Feed the Beast Beyond. And we have got some stuff to do. We have plenty of blaze rods going, as you can see. And we got done mining over the mining dimension. As a matter of fact, I had to get a second vanilla chest just to put some stuff in. Get all of our stuff here and here, and we got that one little patch all done. Took a while because we weren't using an extreme amount of power. So, what we need to do now is find a place to put all this stuff so we can start processing it. So, we are going to delve into a little mod called Refined Storage. Kind of reminiscent of old AE applied, energi uh, applied energistics. All right, so we're going to want these. First thing we want to make is the controller. So we've got all the stuff set up to make five of these. So we need one of them getting power. And we can, I believe, connect up the other ones. Or do they each need their own power? Hmm. I wonder. The next thing we're going to need is a solderer. And some cables. Some glass. Do I have any glass? I got some glass. So we need some cables. So. Let's see. Not sure why that popped up out of the ground like that, but okay. Let's get all these puppies going with power. Oh, okay. Um, can you not have them beside each other when they're powered? Did I find a bug? Okie dokie. Well, then I guess we won't do it like that. Okay. Let's just take a fill this back in then. What the heck was that? Strangeness is happening. Okay, this is a solderer. This is what you need to make all these good guys. So, the next thing we're going to need is we're going to need some of these, but we're going to need a place to put those. So, we're going to need a disk drive. We need machine casing, advanced processor, which is diamond. Okay, so we need some iron going. Get some of that going. I need some diamonds done, gold done, some silicone. Let's start off with those and get some printed silicone going and we can make upgrades to make this go faster. Let's see, where are the speed upgrades? Range, speed. You can start off with these, but you need those. You need four of those. 
which is well, the printed improved process, which is just gold, I believe. Yep. And that with some quartz iron glass to make the basic. And then the speed upgrade is sugar redstone. Let's go ahead and make some of those. Do I need to go upstairs to get some sugar cane? I believe I do. Really gotta get that elevator working. Well, not working, I gotta actually build one. Let's go out back and get our shoes and sugar cane. And my sugar cane on. That's right, it's over here. Plenty of sugar cane. Alrighty. I'm gonna pop over and get some redstone too. I'll show you what I did. Because the uh, Ender IO generators were running so slow, I decided to upgrade it to some magma crucibles. No, crucibles, magma, magma, magmatic thingies. <laughs> uh, I'll see. I'll show you. From thermal expansion. Magmatic dynamos, there we go. And instead of just using magma in them because we have so many blaze rods, I went ahead and made some blazing pyrothium because it makes more energy. And yeah, that was our setup. So, if I remember correctly, you can break these and they hold their inventory. Or am I wrong? Yep, holds his inventory. We got all this stuff. We'll come back for this later. I just wanted the redstone. Alrighty. Walking, 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 look at I'm walking. Make some steak. I need these, so I might as well make a couple. Put some of this stuff in here for now. Alrighty. Where are we at? Where are we at? I think I'm going to need a little bit of wood. And I think a chest or two. Wood? Do I have any wood? There we go. Oh, this disk manipulator. I need this. I'm going to need a chest for that, which is fine. Actually, you know what? Let's let's do. I can do four, so let's do four of these. Because I want to make the speed upgrades first. Oh, 
also going to need more of this, I believe. Oh, no, it just goes like this. There we go. One more to do. And we'll get some more. Those being printed up. Like this. I need this. I need four of them. And I need sugar. Put some more stuff away because I'm running out of space. All right, so we want sugar, redstone, and this. Here's one. Should get progressively quicker as we get through these. This is going to help out a lot. Okay, so now what are we what, what are we doing here? Need there we go and we got that so let's pump those back in there get made up this is where these discs go Hold all of our information. All right, sorry about that. Let's get. We're gonna want some basic. Okay. We also need a grid. So we need a construction, deconstruction, to improve machine casings. Okay, so we need some basics. One of these, and we need one of these. What are those? Okay, now we need a couple of these. We should be able to make this. Boom. Grid, but we're not stopping there, folks. We want a crafting grid, so we need a crafting table. That was that, I believe. Yep, need an advanced. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. 
We are almost there, folks. Ooh, but we have no space yet because we haven't made any any of these processors yet for storage. So let's see what it takes to make some one case. Oh, I need redstone. Well, I think I got a little bit right here. Okay. 16. You know, 1Ks are okay, but it's always better to go up. Make two of those. We just need some more basics. We can make some more. Yeah. So 4Ks. Make a 16k. So right there, that's not too bad to start out with. So let's let's do that. Storage housing. So we do this one. Do these two, and we'll we'll just save them for for another time. We'll stick these in there. We can hold 24,000 items right now. So, what I can do is just go like this, go boom, boom. What I'm going to do is, well, you know what? You know what we can do? Let's do something a little bit easier than trying to just load everything in. build an importer or I could just put it all in my chest. Well let me take and show you what what we can do. See this? Because I'm not gonna bore you with like doing every chest manually. This is what we can do. See? Granted, this seems like it's going to take up a lot of space, but it's fairly easy to make more storage. And that is what I'm going to do. And this mod really doesn't use that much energy, which is good, because I'm not producing a ton of it. So I think between episodes, I'm going to upgrade my storage system. And then I'm going to work on a power system. Now I'm going to ask you now, you can leave in the comments if anybody bothers watching the video, um, should I do a deep residence energy system to start with, or should I go into extreme reactors, or figure out some kind of other funky power generation system. So just leave in the comments, let me know what you think. When you're done watching the video, please go over and like and subscribe, even if you didn't like it, like it anyways, because I'm desperate and I need the views and the likes and all that. So I will see you next time and I will have this place cleaned up. Toodaloo!